Mmm, those were some good pancakes. So glad I came out tonight. It's getting late though. I'd better make a stop at the restroom real quick before hitting the road. They got a Deftones album on here. Nice. Oh, what's that you say? The president's face is on fire? And you want me to put it out? Well... If my country needs me. What's this? Some kind of note? wonder who left it. That's strange. It seems to be locked. But I just came through it not two seconds ago. And didn't I just leave out the back door? Another note. I wonder what it says. Happening. Am I going crazy or something? Hello? Can anyone hear me? interdimensional travel and you. Hello, and welcome to the exciting world of interdimensional travel. It can be pretty exciting to wander the mysterious landscapes of the multiverse, but it can also be dangerous. Remember to always follow the interdimensional rules and regulations when passing between possibility scapes. To begin the instruction, insert tape now. What was all that? This whole situation keeps getting stranger by the minute. Wonder if I find any more of those things. <laughs> Holy crap.
take the fundamentals of moving through the multiverse. Imagine an ant crawling across a sheet of paper. We can think of the paper as representing a plane of existence, and the ant is us. Technology has finally progressed to the point where it is now possible to connect different planes of existence, the same way we can connect two or more sheets of paper. Just as the ant moves from page to page, you too can travel from existence to existence. Insert tape for more information. Avoiding paradoxes. Our actions as interdimensional travelers can echo unforeseen consequences across the farthest reaches of infinity. Therefore, we must tread carefully to avoid setting into motion any event that could alter the course of other planes of existence. Remember, the care and maintenance of other worlds and their inhabitants is everyone's responsibility. Refer to the handbook, The Do's and Do Not Do's of Interdimensional Travel that ship with your device for more information. worthless it's it's different this time you know it really is it it, it certainly is that old son of a bitch it's, it's different this time you know it really is it it, it certainly is <sighs> What the hell? <laughs> oh shit. Cape D. Fifth Dimensional Travel 101. As a user of 5D technology, your capabilities for passage stem beyond our fifth dimensional status to lower levels of existence. Think back to the idea of an ant traveling along a sheet of paper. Imagine now if the paper were to be rolled up so that both ends are now touching. As the end moves from one end of the sheet to the next, a loop is created. Inhabitants of this existence 
are bound to the seat as their forms are governed by the laws of this dimension. As a fifth dimensional traveler, however, you are free to cross to any point on any plane at any given moment. Such freedoms must be tempered with caution, as failure to act within the safety guidelines could disrupt not only the currently occupied possibility space, but rupture adjacent planes of existence as well, causing great rifts to echo across the infinity sphere. Travel with caution. It's an intruder, and, and they make us kill intruders. I know someone's there! I do what I'm told! I just do what I'm told! I, just I always do, to do what I'm told! I just want to go to sleep. I just... What I'm told! I just do what I'm told! I always just do what I'm told! of interdimensional safety laws and regulations. In order to maintain balance between planes of existence, special enforcers, commonly referred to as quantum keepers, are dispatched to nullify any paradoxes that may arise. The sole purpose of these creatures is to track down any paradoxical entity that can present itself within a looping time scale. Once any threat is eliminated, they simply fade from existence and convert to dark matter state until the need calls upon them again, repeating the cycle as necessary. Though frightening in appearance, the Quantum Keeper plays a crucial role in protecting against paradoxes that may otherwise spread to surrounding planes of existence and restore order to the multiverse. now. are coming.
What's wrong with them? It's like looking at a ghost. You? That's right! None of this was your fault! You were simply caught up in something I was doing! I don't... understand. Maybe this will clear things up. Remember this? That's... is that... me? In a way. I'm not like you, you know. Where I come from, all possibilities exist both all at once and not at all. I don't expect you to understand. Your kind simply can't. But I've come to realize I made a big mistake, and I must spend the rest of what you call forever fixing that mistake. You're... you're going to be doing this... forever? No, silly! <laughs> Just for what you call forever. Forever's not as long as you think it is. But that's not for you to understand. Not now, anyway. Will I ever understand all that's happened here? Perhaps, in time. But right this second, wouldn't you rather leave this place? I... yes. Then go. Out the front door this time. Go before you end up leaving out the back again. Go. You are the one who leaves.